about this 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 is great i i could not wait to get back it, it was terrible i really wanted to uh to be bright and chipper on monday when we got back from camping but i was just not there you you would not have enjoyed it i swear <laughs> and that i didn't mean to rhyme that that's just, that just sort of happened how's everyone doing though i'm excited to hear how everyone's been um i i I'm sure you don't care to see anything, but I, I do have some some vids of some fish and whatnot, which will go into some uh, some videos later on. But you know, excited to see so many people in the chat to start out. That's awesome. Dev Boss is here. What's going on, man? Ross Allen, Os Pogo, Jam is here. Dakota Solomon, Don Hudson, Phase Trum, uh, Cressy, uh, Fuse, Risky, Kevin Howell. Uh, let's see. I'm looking. I'm looking for more names. Ethan, Ethan Rawlings, Slinky, Don Hudson. I already said that. Juicy Hands, Ace Noob Killer, Manning. Fontes is here for. Oh, oh, Fontes got a big old carp today. We went out fishing today and then got a monster carp. That was that was a lot of fun. Tell you what, let's open up a private room. That way people can join in if they want to. We're fishing blue crab today everyone i'm sure at some point we might get tired of blue crab but uh we're very close to moving back into the amazon so we just gotta keep going gotta keep going oh look at this good night okay so it is actually pretty good fishing so but i don't know what we have we've caught a few fish haven't we unique common snook that's it boy i wish i could have caught a common snook while we were out there just didn't didn't work out man <clears throat> we'll start out with some of this stuff and then we might move into uh fishing maybe on the fresh water the more fresh water side um as well as maybe trying some top water tarpon or something like that too so we'll just have to see anyway 
Back on blue crab manning says absolutely Recently fish plan low to it's fun to use. It is fun to use Nathaniel. You are correct What's this about? Ethan Rawlings following the hub. Hey right on man. Appreciate it. Kevin Howell. Hi. Hello everyone Lucas Elliot. Hello. When do you think of the Call the Wild Clue? What's coming next in your opinion? You know, I wanted to put out uh, a, a BZ news about this, but um, at the moment, at the moment, I, I'm venturing to think that uh, it's probably uh, a Mexico map. That's that's where my brain is at the moment. I'm thinking we might be looking at a Mexico map in the, in the future, in the near future. I don't see any fish jumping out here, but let's try. Actually, let, let's let's I'm gonna put this down. I'm gonna go look over here. Maybe there's fish jumping over here. There is fish jumping over here. We should have stayed over here. Why did we go over over here? Let's move to the other side. Change the name, Declan. Change the name. Hey, right on. You're in the outer banks. Ooh, okay. In the outer banks. Outer banks. Got one day of school left. Let's go, Bryson. Hey, right on, man. That's awesome. That's got to be a good feeling, eh? Let's toss these into this uh, big pooling water here. Hopefully, it, it means something good. Something good's over yonder. Said it twice because I like the sound of Don. See, you caught me. You caught me. That's exactly what it is, man. <laughs> love these streams hey we'll ride on i love to hear it you said uh, you're a higher level than me well i'm not sure i guess i i've been doing a lot of fishing in real life i've been playing a lot of other games you have to remember i have like i don't even know let's get an up-to-date let's get an up-to-date uh number here I have 393 games in my Steam library. So, li library. 393 games in my Steam library. Fishing Planet happens to be one of them. I love Fishing Planet, don't get me wrong, but I do love other games as well. So, trying to balance, you know? You know how it is. Little uh, redfish? Little redfish, good deal. I caught one of those bad boys. Can't wait to put out the video on that. Good night. That was a whistle right there, right in the microphone. Looks like a black drum. A little black drum. What do you think our first unique of the night will be? Anyone? Anyone got any guesses? At least we're catching fish. That's a good thing. Hey, this is your first stream. Recently found your channel and got into Fish Planet Racks. Bro, it's a great game. I mean, to be, to be a free game, can it get much better than this? I don't think so. It's a it's a lot of fun. You're in for a lot of fun, Rax. Don't waste your time at Maku Maku Lake. Waste of time and money. Oh yeah, I've got to try it. I've got to go there and 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 see the fish and catch them, man. <clears throat> Plus, I got I got plenty of money. I'm not really worried. Misty Hughes, how's it going? Why is he floating on water? <gasps> Are we floating on water right now? Oh, what? Oh. I don't see any. I don't see any floating on water going on. Level twenty-seven. Should I go to White Moose or should you wait till level thirty and go to Saint Croix? You know, if you're hurting for money, um, you, up to you. I, I usually just say play the game, have fun. If you want to catch a giant lake trout, which will probably be one of your largest fish you've caught in the game, if you're leveling up, uh, go catch a ginormous lake trout, a white a white moose. They're they're a ton of fun, and uh, and if you haven't been there and caught one, then go there and catch one. Otherwise, Saint Croix is one of my favorite lakes to fish at, just because of all the pike. I love fishing for all the pike, so uh, I don't know. I, I like both. It's hard to say one or the other because I I do like both of them. A little what is this? this another? It's a snook. It is a little snook. You know, we never did catch one snook. My my dad got so close to catching one. And we had it right up next to the boat and it and the line broke. It was so sad because it was a monster snook. So gosh dang it. Could have been a unique. Who's to say? Good old unicorn snook down in Florida. 
What is my favorite lake? Ooh, yeah. Well, I do like St. Croix. Um, I like Weeping Willows. I thought Weeping Willows was a ton of fun. Uh, getting into the carp fishing there. Um, Everglades is always a good time. Uh, blue crab is fun with the tarpon and the other kind of saltwater fish. There, there's plenty of different lakes. I don't know if I could narrow it down to one though. It, they're, they're all pretty fun. Help you finish the missions on Lenny Villa. Hey, yeah, absolutely. You need that's kind of your uh, your beginning carp rod, those feeder rods. So yeah, absolutely. I guess they'd be more for uh, your whitefish, the uh, the tension and whatnot too. So yeah. What's your PB of all fishing in real life in Fishing Planet? Well, in Fishing Planet, let's see. It's the Trophy Arapaima right now. Only 233 pounds, but a nice fish all the same. Right now, though, in real life, um, of course, there are a number of fish I, I didn't weigh growing up. But right now, I, I if you if you saw the BZ Hub Instagram or uh, or in the Discord, we caught a a giant red drum while down in Florida. So I think that might that might be taking the cake at the moment almost 44 inches long uh 30 some pounds it was a giant he was awesome so i know they get bigger but uh but he was he was awesome for sure draggy odds here how's it going only one more day of the crazy ela teacher is that right <laughs> oh 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 you gonna take it you're nibbling a lot i i dealt with a lot of this while camping a lot of uh nibbling Finally have the Amazonian maze unlocked. Ooh, fantastic, Don. That's awesome. I'm leveling up those in real life fishing sets. Exactly right. Yeah. Guy is buying proud. It's been a while, but you're back. Hey, you're right on, man. Glad you're back. Uni tarpon. Uh, you think so? Man, that would be a first because we haven't gotten an uni tarpon. I think since we've been here, the first uni, uni tarpon we caught was uh, on a topwater lure back when we had the Bass Boat Explorer pack, and we haven't caught one since. A snook, a snook, a tarp, a red drum. First tarpon in the glades, 30 pounder. Hey, right on. Yeah, when you catch your first tarpon in the Everglades, depending upon what, uh, what rod and reel you're using that can be it that can be quite a, a wake-up call the snooks can be that way as well especially if you get into a unique one what's the best bait for lake trout and white you know i don't know i always use a red tiger spoon a medium red tiger spoon um that's that's what I always use. So I don't know what the best bait would be. I'm sure you could look you could look at what they uh, what they bite on though, and you'd probably be able to see. Don't understand the carp rod yet. It, it takes some it takes some getting used to. I love when you streamed at Saint Croix. I loved fishing at Saint Croix too. too. Oh, right when I leave, we get a bite. How about that? Now that seems. I was gonna say it seemed like a sizable fish, but now I'm realizing it's just another little snook. That's okay. Come on, big fish, big fish, big money, big money. Can't tell if he's a big fish or if he's just, nah, he's not, he's a bone fish. Gosh dang it. Small fish. They're all small fish. Can you play cross-platform on Fishing Planet? You can if, uh, if your friends downloaded Fishing Planet on a PC from the Microsoft Store. And then you play on Xbox. That is the only uh, uh, crossplay that there is. So, yeah. Badamaku Maku is the far right spawn. Ooh, okay. We'll just have to see about that. 216.62 trophy error pine. I'm Missy Hughes. Hey, right on. This beat your in real life PB bass, your local leg. You're really proud of it. Five pounds flat, dude. Right on. That's awesome. You're wearing your merch right now. Ooh, ooh. What are you? What are you wearing, Van D? Give me, give me, give me uh, more uh, details. I want to know. Uh, I'm, I'm paying attention. I'm seeing what people are into. 
A lot of people liked the uh, the diamond whitetail. Um, some people really like the diamond elk. Um, but I'm, I'm eager to see what people are, are liking. Hopefully Uni Tarpon did. I agree. We we don't have too much longer. It's going to be nighttime before we know it. Oh, maybe I should throw out my other rods. Do you think that would help? This sizable fish. Nothing's really pulling us yet, though. Like, nothing what we catch is pulling us out. God, we have not even caught a trophy yet. Seriously. Do we need to put on a larger hook? I, I, I like following people's uh, guidance while playing, but sometimes I wonder if I uh, if I'm messing messing stuff up. XX Tyler with the fall. Hey, thank you so much, dude. Appreciate it. Ooh, all the swells went away. We might have to check the other side. They might have changed changed where I was coming. Try using the buzz bay. They're great for talking. You know what? I think we tried that last time, Dragiot. You had mentioned that, and uh, and we tried it out, and we didn't catch anything. But uh, we can always try it again here in a bit. Grinding yesterday at a local creek for green sunfish for catfishing. Hey, right on, dumb man. That's awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Uh, today, actually, while I was fishing with uh, the chef, A. Fontes, uh, we caught a humongous carp, but at the same time, I had my my fly rod, and I was catching some green sunfish and whatnot. So that was a lot of fun, for sure. Forty pound uni snook, hey, right on. Kevin Howell, good night. Hey, take care, man. Muddy Wood, Ray Regier, Regier. Hi, GSM Master J Epic. What's up? What's up? What is the best money earning lake below low twenty? Uh, probably Everglades, I would assume. I think that's it, right? Everglades is at 18, I want to think. Something like that. Tan Gamer, hi. Van D, hello. Nate's hunting and fishing. Hey, Bo, do you remember me? You know the rule, man. I remember everyone. JSM, Master J, Epic. What's up, BZ? You inspire me. Oh, my gosh. Inspire you for what? Hopefully not my... Uh, my my uh, oh my my interests in food, which is pretty much everything, you know. If you do that, you'll end up like me and just get fat, you know. But at least you get to eat a lot of good food. You know, I, I I take that back. If I inspire you to to eat lots of food, that's that's fine. Just make sure it's good food. Kevin, how following that? Hey, thank you so much, Kevin. Victor Torgia. Hey, dude, what did you miss? Not a whole lot. A lot of smaller fish at the moment. We're still got 45 minutes, but we might move. Problematic with the follow. Thank you so much. We might move to the opposite side. Mix it up a bit. Or, 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 we do have... We can, uh, we can try, uh, while we're over here, we can try Dragiot's thing. Do you think we should throw a Shad on there, Dragiot? Almost nighttime. Let's throw a glow in the dark on there. Oh, oh, I hear beeping. I hear beeping. What's the best bait for tarpon? Oh, good question. I f I'm trying to figure that out as well. Um, my, uh, our captain down in Florida seemed to think that scaled sardines were a good, a good bait for, for tarpon. I, said, I brought it up, you know, when I talked to people about, ooh, this is a big black drum. Big black drum. Ooh, just a trophy, though. I was ready, man. I was ready to hit that button. 2,956, 1,600 XP. Right on, right on, man. That's awesome. I never did catch a black drum while I was down there. But, uh, but a red drum, yes. Eating Captain Crunch. Hey, right on. I dig it. All right, let's go. Back over here. Bruh, one dislike. Aw. Oh, a doll. That's okay. 32 pound common carb in real life. Bro, 32 pounds. That's awesome, Keegan. Yeah, that's sweet, dude. Nice catch. That that beats me. My best is 15.5. So you got like double. Double plus a pound. Did I get the fish at the end of the last stream? I don't know. I don't know, probably. Once I got him, I got him, you know. 
but I'm only on Lone Star. Hey, bro, there was a point where I was only on Lone Star, so you keep at it. I'm gonna call it a small fish, exactly. Is it better to fish at night at Blue Crab? We're gonna find out, aren't we? You know, I haven't really gotten used to the uh, the different days at Blue Crab. I have, uh, you know, y you spend enough time fishing for pike or fishing for bass at Everglades, uh, pike at St. Croix, and you kind of get an idea of like which days are best to fish for pike. And I haven't gotten to that point here at the Everglades. Um, the days are kind of just poor altogether. Um, so yeah, might have to do a little more research, I suppose. Bob the hoodie with the largemouth bass and the shirt with the catfish. Bro, right on, Van D. That's awesome. I have the shirt with the catfish. I love that one. Uh, I don't have the bass one. My brother does, though. My brother has the bass shirt. That's sweet, though. Right on, man. I have a Apollo Pro Series, and how are you doing? Is there any chat police? Only me. There's a squish flint. Oh my gosh, a wild squish flint appears. The Canadian train. Squish Flint in the house. You have to go have an amazing night, Muddy Wood. You as well. Take care. Let's see. Here we go. Uber B. Hey, how's it going? I got the dog on Hunter Call of the Wild. And I think it's a useless. Stupid dog. Bro. You know what? The dog is so not useless. It's it's fun to have around. <laughs> it's a fun dog. You know, here's the thing. Say what you want about the Bloodhound. They needed to try a dog in the game. Um, waterfowl in the game. They float to you. So uh, how would a waterfowl dog really do do much? The geese. Uh, I'll be honest. I, I think when you shoot four or five ducks or geese or something like that waiting for your dog to come back and bring you every single one of those ducks or goose like it takes forever and i would rather just go grab it myself so they needed to put out a dog that everyone could use and that's the bloodhound man robbie g with a fall hey thanks robbie appreciate it what days do you stream monday and wednesday first time in the stream hyper x hey glad you're here glad you're here I tell you what, this this is really slowed down. Really slowed down. Let's jump up on here. We'll change the time. Right in the thick of the night time. We're gonna we're gonna I tell you what, if there's a if there's a better Well there isn't. There's not a better time to test if nighttime is better or daytime. We're just gonna have to see. Here we go. Throw them out. Are we going to stream now next to? Of course we are. Of course we are. I'm going to throw the scaled sardine out in the middle. For big old tarpon. Number six. Hola. Number six, I said. Is that just at the left at the docks? Don't know. What are we talking about? What's at the left of the docks? Missy Hughes is uh, level 37. Hey, right on. That's awesome. <laughs> Kai, how's it going? Saying hi to Squish. Oh, 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 oh brought these sand fleas i'm trying out a different bait i want to see what uh what the fish are biting on we'll remember so far they're kind of biting on everything so uh i'm waiting for one of the baits to really take over and be like the bait you know that's doing well let's let's look let's see so this unique common snook we caught on the scaled tar sardine um couple of trophies scaled sardine large minnow and crab so two so far i mean those aren't great fish but uh two on the scaled sardine so far but still a little little spread out we will see 
Might want to try a shad jig. It goes, you. <laughs> 102 pound alligator gar. Bro, Ethan, that's a giant alligator gar. I think that it may beat me. I'm not sure. I had a giant alligator gar. Don't you get me wrong. Let's see. It's got to be up here. There it is, 98.783. So you definitely, definitely beat me. That is a great, that is a great alligator gar, man. I love the alligator gar. I, I'm waiting for them to put a unique in the game, because my god, could you imagine? The gar models in this game are really nice. Glad to have you back, Austin Williams. I'm glad to be back, sir. Thanks for being here, man. First day back, it's so awesome to see so many people are back. You always wonder when you come back, you think, uh, has everyone found new things that they enjoy? No one, no one's gonna show up. <laughs> but everyone showed up, it's great. First time in the stream, Hyper says, hey, right on, glad you're here. Another red fish here on the crab. The regular redfish, man. Come on, come on. When is the next fishing planet guide, bro? I tell you what. I've been doing so much in real life fishing that uh, it's, it's hurting my ability to edit videos. So, I don't know. I definitely need to put one out here soon, though. Definitely need to. Tony Kincaid, welcome back. Hey, thank you so much. Made a mistake and bought a bait coin to get two rods at once. To get two rods at once. What do, what do you mean there, GSM Master J Epic? Made a mistake, bought bait coin to get two rods at once. Two rods at once. I don't know what that means. Photos vids on Insta made it look like a heck of a time. Looked great, but hey, thank you so much, Squish. It, it was It was something else. I have it all recorded, so I'm excited to uh, put together a video. Lord Head is here. First time here. Well, glad you're here. It's fantastic. Let's see if we can uh, grab ourselves something with this. We're like fishing at the best time to fish, so we're not catching anything. I don't know what to say. Look for swirls and use a buzz bait. Well, there's no swirls over here. There is no swirls to use a buzz bait. Helps me get through the day. Thank you so much for helping me get tons of work done and keep up the good work. Hey, I'm glad, man. That's awesome. You know, I do the same thing. I don't listen to me myself, but I, I'll, I'll listen to uh, shows and and stuff while I'm working. It does get me through the day, for sure. BZ from the land down under, Robbie G, how's it going, man? Do you come from the land down under? Do you, do you, do you, do you, do you, do you, do you. I come from the land up over, you know? Just picked up your five week old puppy. Ooh, fantastic, Tony, that's awesome. Hope to see some pictures. Uh, maybe you have. I, don't, I just haven't paid attention, but hope to see some pictures down on the, uh, the BZ Hub Discord pets page. I love seeing people's dogs and stuff. I'm, I get I get giddy when I see dogs. I can't help it. I just, I just love dogs. <laughs> I become a little kid. I'm super happy and my voice goes high. <laughs> Do you just go to the left but a little bit further up? Um, I don't think so. I mean, if you're asking where I am, Declan, I'm way down here. So I am I am on the right side from the starting docks and way towards the bottom. So nowhere near. Did you miss anything? Sun and mom fishing, not a whole lot. We're just uh, we're just fishing around right now, hoping for the best. Trying some uh, some buzz baits with a with a glow in the dark shad. Hoping we can catch something, but nothing's really happened. It's 
still entertaining to watch. Well, hyper glad it is. Glad it is, man. I tell you what, though, this light is like making me start to sweat. Jeez, Louise. There's level five pronghorn right in front of you. What? Use. Better pull that trigger, man. Better get get that boy down. Do I know of the catfish and carp? I do. I love the catfish and carp YouTube channel. That guy seems like a guy that I could hang out with. I think that's what I enjoy about him. Seems he seems like a pretty cool guy. I think if if I could be uh, something something of of him when I'm his age, I will I will think that will be. I've done a pretty good job growing up, I guess. <laughs> I want to say you have helped me learn a lot about fishing planet. Whoa, crazy shooter! Hey, glad. That's awesome. You know, that's that is um. Uh, that was really the whole point of the beginner series that we started. Yeah, they're a little silly. Hopefully they're kind of funny. Uh, it is interesting to see like a time machine of like how our video started and where we are now. But uh, if anything, I hope it does help in uh, in watching me learn the hard way and, and you learn the easy way watching me suffer. So hopefully it's good. Hunter man, hi. It's Rubo. I've indeed found new things to enjoy. I'm leaving Slime Rancher. <gasps> leaving Slime Rancher? Oh my gosh. <laughs> try large cut bait. You think that's what I need to try? Large cut bait? Try catching a gaff top sail catfish. You know, at this point, I'd, I'd kind of just... I'd kind of just like catching any any sort of fish. We have some nibbles going on right now. Waiting, waiting. Some news for the clues on the new kind of the hundred call of the wild. Yeah, I've thought about it. I haven't looked into what other people have said, but I have my ideas. Here's the thing. I know I'm giving you kind of like a, 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 once I tell you there's no reason to watch the BZ news but here's the thing they put out the water bottle when I first looked up the water bottle uh, there was a lot of stuff about China and I thought oh that's pretty cool okay uh, yeah maybe it's maybe it's we're, we're having a place in China and then further further later I guess or later on um, Magels said uh, that it being found in Layton was a hint of its own. And so I thought, okay, what could that mean? Maybe it means that uh, it's another map in North America. Um, the Rocky Mountain boxing gloves uh, were also found in Layton Lake. Uh, I'm sure other things that didn't relate to North America might have also been found. In, in there but uh that's what i'm thinking anyway um that it relates to a north american map and if you look up water jugs in north america yes there's some stuff about missouri there's some stuff about swamps but i'll tell you if you look up a mexican water jug it looks it looks the exact same as the one in the game and uh people have been talking about wanting a desert map for a long time and i uh, and i think that a mexican deserty map pronghorn mule deer coos deer javelina um I, I think people would really enjoy that um especially if they decide to uh, put some i don't even know some quail or something in there that would really push it over the edge but Crazy shooter following the hub. Hey, thank you so much. Um, I think an upland bird of any choice would really automatically make that one of my favorite maps to play on. <laughs> I just want something. I want something challenging that I can go find. I want some. I want some pheasants, man. <laughs> Love your call of the wild vids. Well, Lord Hedris, thank you. Cat is a big baby. Oh my goodness. Why is that? On the phone to crush, should I ask her out? Ooh, I don't know. I what what sort of signs are you getting, Hyper? What sort of signs is she is she giving you? Is she not talking very much or is she talking a lot? 
maybe go with that. If she's if she's uh, having an an active dialogue with you, I, I would I would say go for it. If she's uh, if she's hesitant to to answer your questions, maybe hold back. I don't I don't know if that means anything, but that's that's what I would go with. <laughs> Beeping. Hey, that's a fish on. That's a fish on. Finally, big fish. Big. Oh, it is a big fish. Okay. Whoa. Those are some crazy scales. May I? Dare I say that this might be uh, a unique here? When you see the uh, when you see the meters hopping up and down like this, it's usually the sign of a unicorn. Who? Wants to see an unicorn. Would love to meet him or you someday, Victor Torchia. Sounds good, man. I agree. That would be awesome. I I'd love to meet anyone, honestly. I keep thinking the first day I run into someone who actually recognizes me. First off, I really hope that I don't look super mad because I kind of have a, a resting face that's kind of just kind of like I look angry, but I'm not. Usually, usually I'm mildly frustrated with what's going on in front of me, but but no. Uh, if you ever see me, feel free to say hi. And the first time uh, I meet someone, I'll probably freak out because I don't have any stickers on my person. But uh, I cannot wait. It'll be awesome. <clears throat> Fishing addiction made it. Hey, you're right on, man. Glad you're here. Scrubs is back. Scrubs is back back again scrubs is back tell a friend catching the monster smallmouth buffalo ooh, ooh. why did you not do the live on monday you know man i really wanted to do the live on monday but i got back to the house from camping and fishing at six o'clock and uh it was an hour and a half from the stream and i was just i was honestly just tired and uh thinking about doing it was just uh yeah seemed like a lot of work <laughs> so i kind of just took an easy night black drum here we go i'm ready oh you're kidding me dude how is it only a trophy i was so ready i was so thinking that we had an unicorn on there three thousand one hundred and eighty seven dollars though 1800 xp gosh dang it man i thought that was it i thought we'd finally caught one on the crab too Here's the thing, uh, drum, drum obviously have like uh, like like plates in their mouth to crush things with a uh, hard with hard shells and stuff like that. Um, uh, I uh, obviously they, they can crush it so they can eat it. Um, that that's kind of how we were fishing for them down in Florida was we were actually using lures that. Um, that didn't look like crabs, but they were floating on top of the water, um, just like the crabs were hanging on to seaweed. So, uh, so that's a good way to catch those drums is uh, is using crabs, because um, they do like to go for for things with hard shells because they can eat it. And that's why if you uh, if you have if you live near a lake or something like that that has tiger mussels or, or anything to that to that sort, uh, and you catch um gas or or freshwater drum yeah uh, you'd be doing your lake a favor to throw them back in because those drum are probably one of the only fish in that lake that can eat those tiger mussels so uh so throw them back in help out your lake hopefully get rid of some of those tiger mussels <laughs> use a frog lure you know ethan i don't think i have a frog lure Bo likes pheasants? Unheard of. Yeah, I know. I, I, that's one of those uh, one of those little uh, factoids I've been keeping to myself. I didn't want anyone to know about me wanting pheasants. <laughs> Henry Barber, what's going on, man? Got the pronghorn? Ooh, better post a picture in the Discord fuse. Better see it. I'm going to be getting a microphone for my computer. So I'm going to start making music. Ooh, making music. Right on, crazy. That's awesome. Just wants to play in my in sleeping. He goes under the covers and bites your toes. Whoa, your your toes must smell like tuna or something, man. That can't be good. You throw your line out 40 feet for the unique tarpon. Well, 
we uh i think we did that i think we did it. that and more ethan hovington got a dog well right on You finally caught the monster. You knew I'd bring you luck. Hey, right on, right on. I'm glad. What are my secrets to catching fish? Well, at the moment, I don't have any secrets for blue crab because this isn't working out at all. We've caught a few fish, but nothing special. I say, see, here's the thing. When you look at uh, the fishing at blue crab, like what, what looks like an amazing day to you for fishing? This day has like, four hours of decent fishing these days have like four hours of decent fishing these days have three hours of mediocre fishing and four hours of decent fishing like all of these days look mediocre at best and so that's what it's like there's nothing that like reaches out of me like oh man i need to skip forward to day six to fish this because because of this like there's nothing there's nothing telling me that sort of thing. They all look bad. <laughs> so, uh, so when you ask me what uh, what day I think is best for fishing blue crab, I, I don't know what to tell you because they all look bad. You live in New York. Hey, I've been in New York multiple times, man. You never know. I mean, there's millions of people in New York, but there's a possibility you could run into me. <laughs> And you do Vool, Skull Gaming. Cool. Oh, okay. Right on. Hey, man. I'm I, I glad. I'm glad that you enjoy the the old content and the new. I'm glad you're here. I always enjoy people tuning into their first stream. That's a, that is awesome. To think that uh, you know, you watched a video of mine, and uh, and you took the time to to not only. Uh, remember that I had a stream but to show up is is fantastic to those of you who uh, who saw that I have a stream on Wednesdays and Mondays and stuff like that let's um I don't know what do you think I like fishing the mornings for uh, topwater tarpon but um I don't know oh, this could be a bad choice marker buoy 31,000 thank you for the marker buoy all right, well, let's go try to catch some fish, I guess. I see fish jumping over here. Big swells, big swells. Trans Minecraft, hello, hello, how are ya? Come on, big fish. Hey, when I look behind me and I see like all the commotion of the boat and I'm like trying to make out if there was a fish like right there. Is that a fish or was that me? I'm guessing it was me. Big fish, big fish. Anything? Bro, there's no fish on the radar even. Oh, thank you, Cody. I'm glad. I'm glad it I'm hoping it's good insane, bro. Still trying to catch the dreaded pike slasher so in oh, awe, bro. I had a lot of trouble with the pike slasher. I I understand that. Yeah. I remember being so annoyed with the Pike Slasher, but I'll be honest, uh, I was more annoyed with the, um, oh, what was it? The, um, the Dendro Fin. Just because you have to cast out for the Dendro Fin the entire time versus the Pike Slasher, you just have to wait there. So I would just wait there and like watch Hulu or Netflix or YouTube videos and uh, wait for him to bite or more, more likely not bite and not catch anything. 
Connor Quesnel, hello, hello. Glad you're here. You're not that late, bro. It's okay. Fishing, do you uh, have fish brain? If you do, what's your account on it? My my account on fish brain is BZ Hub. You can follow me if you have fish brain on your on your phone. You can find me on there. Go bear. Use crabs and large minnows, seven out hook, barbless, 18 inch swallow rod. Uh, yeah, that's exactly what we were doing there, Ace Noob Killer. I'm not sure if you were the one who told us to do that last time, but we were not catching anything that big, so we actually moved up hook sizes to size eights. Might try a uh, medium. Medium spoon. Oh, here's a crankbait. Let's try this. This will catch a lot of fish. A lot of different types of fish, I guess. seem to be giving you a break oh man don they need to let you go fishing you you know what you just walk up to your manager tomorrow and go hey it's been a while since i've gone fishing so uh i'm leaving today and uh i'll be back tomorrow all right enjoy your day <laughs> Any tips, preferred baits, or best spots? Uh, the only thing I can think of is that people seem to like honey when we were at Lenny Vala. But, uh, but I don't know. That's one of those places I, I really never spent a lot of time at. How we doing today? Happy you're back, 777. Ooh, we just got hit by something there. Hit by something, but not eaten by something. What's the deal? We'll move over here so we can cast out in this direction. Gotta be something in here. Tossing a crankbait. We might move to a medium spoon. We're not getting anything on the crankbait. Fishing for the whole day today. Real life caught 23 rainbow trout in the space of six hours. Bro, that's awesome. Well done. I have caught, I think, two rainbow trout in my entire life. So you've got me beat right now, pure. How many DLC are there? Maximus Boss Heart, uh, for Fishing Planet? Or, or what are you talking about, Maximus? Which which game? I just want to be sure I, I'm talking about the right thing. Tyner Thornhill made $127,000 on the new Amazonian maze and I only leveled 34. Bro. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, man. Um, glad you made some moolah, though. That certainly helps, right? Got some pretty big flatheads. Yeah. Bro, I want to get into a big flathead. It's uh, it's taken me a while, but uh, one of these days I want... Uh, are you serious? I don't have a medium spoon? Bro. Blasphemy. Blasphemy. They actually do have a unique buffalo here, though. Let's see. Casting spoon, medium spoon, soft baits. Hmm. Hmm. Crank baits. Casting spoons. You know, maybe we need to try a casting spoon. God, what do I know? Tackle's too light for the rod. Oh well. Let's try it out. Seems to be doing okay. Probably be reeling it up really fast though, we'll see. That's eh, actually not too bad of motion. Hopefully the, the nighttime coloring doesn't mess up too much. Just hit level 60 RD map, fantastic man, that's awesome. Trans Minecraft with the follow, thanks man, appreciate it. 
No one else really reads the chat, bro. I live to read the chat. That's what keeps me keeps me going, man. For Cali Surgeon, Maceo Bottoms with the follow. Appreciate it, Maceo. I watch you play vision, help me a lot. Thanks for doing what you're doing. Thank you. Hey, thanks, Skulls. Skull Gaming. Easy, you're my soulmate. Is that right? <laughs> Look like happened from the picky post, bro. It was uh, it was all right. It was slow. They had a cold front in Florida, but uh, but it was all right. We made the most of it. We made magic happen. It was great. Um, it was fun to be with my brother and uh, and my dad for a long time. I really I really enjoyed it. I I've never filmed an entire mini golf game, but uh, where we were playing mini golf. I had a GoPro in my backpack and I was like, bro, I got to, I got to, it's like an entire, uh, entire, an entire pirate themed mini golf course. It was really cool. It was like outside, uh, Orlando, like universal studios and all that. And I was like, dude, I, I have to film this mini golf game. So, so I don't know. I'm not sure if you ever watched any mini golf YouTube videos, but, uh, but yeah, no, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna post one on the modern modern day outdoorsman channel because what says modern day outdoorsman like mini golf Austin Martinez how's it going try the red and white casting spoon you know Don I don't think I have that but we'll see Red with honey and a good sinker. Yeah. Where do you fish in real life? Oh, well, fish a lot of places here in Kansas City. Uh, a couple of different lakes, some creeks. Um, I go back home uh, with my my wife and her her folks' house, and we go fishing on rivers and the lake down there. Hot. I don't even know. Thirty plus carp on our camping trip over the weekend. It was so much fun. It, there were times where it was just like every five minutes we had a fish on and it was just one after another caught my first mirror carp I was so excited about that. It was it was awesome Yay fishing planet indeed Do you have any tips for st. Croix uh, match rods man, there's a big fish on the bottom How do I get you should I just throw a match rod out there? We'll find out what it is. I guess What do we got? We have a large minnow. We throw a large minnow out here and see what we catch. See if there's anything out here. Three catfish in 20 minutes on hot dogs. Ooh, man, I've heard that uh, the catfish like hot dogs, so that's awesome. I've never done it before, but uh, that would be sweet. I've only caught one flathead before when I was like 10. Hey, I understand that, man. It's been a hot minute since I've caught a, a flathead. I've caught two. We got, a, we got a bite. Got a, got a nibble. Got a nibble. Nice little redfish. Twenty-one pounder. Not, not amazing, but hey, that's okay. Oh, that's bad through. But it'll work. What did you miss outdoors with Caden? Just, uh, just some fishing, man. Trying to catch some big ones, I suppose. How long are we streaming? We're streaming two, two hours. <laughs> Am I going to catch the perch bully? You know, I actually saw something about that. I think it was an ad or something I, I saw. Um, I'll have to look into that. I'm not sure what what exactly is the perch bully about Riley Yeah, very true. I, I don't make it to Lone Star too often. You know, I get asked to go back to Lone Star by dozens of people and I'll finally go and uh, And like two people will like show up and it's like Come on, man I have like over a dozen people ask me to go to Lone Star and when I do like two people come and, and fish so so understand that when you ask me to play to play at Lone Star uh, I usually 
I'm hesitant to go because because Lone Star is the starting place and a lot of people will start at Lone Star and give up on the game and then never show up to a stream again. So, <laughs> so another place. Go to Everglades. Maybe we'll have a community day on Everglades or something. That might be fun. I love Everglades. I'm not getting much action with this thing. Next stream, I will be level 54. Mark your words. Wow. Well, you have till Monday, so get on it, man. But this is a dope game. Level 35 already. Hey, right on. It is a pretty awesome game, isn't it? I totally agree with you. Should we go try to catch some bass or something? Mix it up. Your mom? Oh my gosh. My mom has two YouTube accounts now. This is crazy. Let's mix it up. Let's go out of this uh, saltwater area. Aha, missed ya. Where? I'm gonna thread the needle here. Oh, okay. Never. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Totally thread the needle, didn't you see that? Threading this needle. Okay, this is not a needle. Okay, backing up the boat. This is not a needle. No, th There's no needle to thread here. I thought there was an opening over there. I must be thinking of another spot. <laughs> Threading the needle. 100% success rate. Woo! Easy peasy. Zero mess ups. Hashtag zero mess ups. Okay, let's go. Can we mess this one up? We'll see. Threading the needle. Take two. 34.89 pound striped bass. Right on, man. What's better, spinners or casting? You know, I like both of them for different things. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Freaking professional, bro. Zero. try this throw a chartreuse on there and the leg of the Ozarks too oh Austin very cool you'll have to uh, compare the two and tell me which one's cooler MJ hello hello what level am I? I think 56. 56 at the moment, I want to say. Our truce caboose. Throwing that buzzing chartreuse caboose. Who we got now? Grapes! First we had my mom and now we have my grapes? This is crazy. Don't tell me this is my dad. Oh, no, nope, it's Riley Tyrell. <laughs> right on, man. Appreciate it. Oh my gosh, they just keep coming. Gotta hit the hay. 4 a.m. comes early dawn. I totally understand, man. Cody Buttery with the follow. Thanks, Cody. Hey, take care, Dawn. Get some sleep. You go, you go uh, tell your manager that you want to go fishing tomorrow. <laughs> Found out that largies like hot dogs, bro. You show up at the right pond, you'll find out that largies like about just anything. Yeah, you've seen the videos of people catching them on GoPros and action figures and stuff like that. Largemouth bass, depending upon the location, become very dumb. So, uh, you know, and when you have a, a nice fighting fish like that, that's that dumb. That's that's why people enjoy them so much. But, uh, I digress. No bass over here anyway. Not dumb over here, evidently. I put this marker here because I caught a unique bass over here, but not pulling anything out of here right now. I don't know why I'm fishing with such a strong rod, though. Halibut fishing for two weeks straight, bro. Well, how many did you get? I'm not even going to ask if you caught any. I'm gonna, uh, how many did you catch? When does the stream end? Yeah, 9.30, Squish has got it. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Bunch of baloney. 
What is this place? Stop hitting. I want to hit R. Let's um. I actually want to put it on. Well, now this one we're using. So there's a big fish on the bottom there. What the heck? Big fish on top too. Why aren't they showing up? They weren't showing up a little bit ago. Big bass, big bass, come on. Come and get him, come and get him. Did they nerf surgeon farming? They did, Nathan. Or uh, Nalho, I don't know why it went with Nathan. What do we get here? A little trophy largemouth, hey, right on. Finally caught one. Goodness gracious. Took long enough. Wish I had a frog. Did you buy that boat with real money? I, I did not. No. I, I don't buy any of the DLCs with, with real money. Unless they're a holiday thing that I want to use for a video or something just to be funny. Um... Usually any any DLCs I get are gifted to me in some way. Wait, we got nipped by something there. What's my favorite map? I I don't know. I honestly, I'm not sure. Um, I should just start saying random ones when I get asked. Just, I'll change it every time. Someone asks me what my favorite map is, and I'll just be like, yeah, Lone Star. Yeah, 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 I love Lone Star. And then next person, I'll just be like, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Rocky Lake. Totally Rocky Lake. It's my favorite. Um, I don't know. I enjoy St. Croix, Blue Crab, Weeping Willows. The list goes on. Ooh. Oh, uh, you pain in the butt. The Legends Wells. Bro, thank you. Uh, bass are usually really dumb until you do a bass terminal. That's when they become smart. They put some of them in the water. I swear. Fishing for catfish in real life right now, bro. Nice. I was doing that uh, on Sunday, right? No, Monday. I was doing that on Monday. That's why I got home so late. Is because I was fishing for catfish. We only caught two, but it was still fun. The one was like eight pounds too. It wasn't a bad size. Best way to level up 46. Um, can you go to San, San Joaquin? It's probably gonna be the sturgeon, even if they nerfed it. I'm, I'm, th I'm guessing the sturgeon are still the best best way to do it. Stocked your pond with 10 bass that weigh 10 pounds. Wow. You must have known a pretty good place to find 10, 10 pound bass, man. Sounds pretty fun, though. Everyone like the stream. Hey, I like your idea Cody But but only like the stream if you like like the video, I guess <laughs> Don't don't want to pressure you or anything You don't I mean if you don't like me then don't like the stream you know? I, yeah. Just just do you do you you know just you do you Well, we're getting some bass anyway not amazing by any means. Ah, oh, no. Press the E. What's the best money method? Uh, fishing at, uh, fishing at the Amazonian maze and catching, uh, Trira. Best pound per money fish in the game. Go do that. That is the best money method. 
You got really skunked? Oh, man. Don't tell me that, because that's how we felt in Florida. Noah Waddle. Wattall? Wattall? Thank you so much for the follow. Yeah, I tell you what, the Legends Wells, I realize I never read your message here. Keep up the work. I love the streams. Tips on Kanique. Tips on Kanique. Frank baits. Medium spoons. Try some spinners, but I never really had any good luck with the big spinners. It's mostly it's mostly medium spoons and crankbaits I've found. Um, and Kanique was a fun place. I, I do enjoy Kanique. It's nothing special. It doesn't have the biggest fish. It doesn't have the most money making fish. But it's definitely a place that you need to go and experience all the same. So. I'm trying to fix something in the console. <laughs> Long time no see, Mikey Halliday says. Ooh, agreed. Best time here where I live, yeah. My brother and I went out um, one uh, late afternoon evening and we stayed out there fishing at a place I thought was going to be perfect for a flathead on the Kansas River and uh, and never caught one. We must have stayed out there from 7 to, to 9 o'clock or something like that. 6.30 to 9 o'clock or something. We couldn't park inside the place. We had to park in a really sketchy place so that we could actually fish where we wanted to fish. It was the craziest fishing I've ever done. And we didn't catch anything. We even went out and like caught a bunch of uh, sunfish before we went and everything, like thinking, thinking it was gonna work out perfectly. Did not, did not work out perfectly. You should use a frog. Sole reason you downloaded the game for Phil the Frog. You know what? I don't think I have a frog, but I'll look. But here's the thing. We were just using a buzz bait, so... <sighs> Bastard. Urgh. If they're not biting on a buzz bait, I really don't foresee them biting on a frog. Plus, all the fish are on the bottom right now. Super Nitro Vlog. Hey, thank you so much. The Legends Wells, do we have a Discord? You bet we do, bro. You bet we do, bro. See, we have no frogs. We have no frogs. Well, they have our uh, poppers too. You know, believe, believe it or not, I, I don't just, uh, if you don't see me using a specific lure, there's a hefty percentage chance that uh, I just don't have it, you know? <sighs> It's you, Cantor. No, you're Ty. You're not Cantor. Can't trick me, Ty. I know Cantor when I when I see Cantor. Your friend Nick Gurr's birthday. Can you, Gurr's, Mr. Mr. Gurr's uh, happy birthday, Aiden. Just caught a trophy eye, dang man. What is your least favorite fish in real life? My least favorite fish in real life? Oh man, I don't know. I don't know if I have a least favorite fish. I like all the fish. I think um, silver carp and big head carp. I wish that I could catch them on lures. Um, they're they're filter feeders. They're not really like carp. They're more like giant minnows. 
um, which is super annoying. I feel like if we were able to uh, catch them on uh, on a rod and reel, that uh, they wouldn't be so annoying. But because we can't, people don't like them. Do you think this big fish was a uh, was a gar? What do you like better, Hunter Call of the Water Fishing Planet? I, I don't know, man. I like both of them. Danae Hess is going to get Fishing Planet. Hey, you better. Hundred and five pound unique drum. Ooh, right on. Carly Priv is here. Hi, Carly. The best Discord. You think you broke your finger at football? Oh no. How'd you how'd you break it? Tell us the story. Hey, Cantor! Bro, there was someone named Ty who was trying to pretend he was you. I didn't fall for it though, man. I didn't I didn't fall for it one bit. Call Tarpon Grantichi? Am I saying that correctly? Grantichi? I just figured that out. See now I'm trying to figure it out. Is it is it something to do with is it just a native language or is it what? What is it? What is it? I've never enjoyed fishing these areas over here. Thought I'd give it a go. But I don't like it. NTG guard. Whoa, look at that. A map shows up on the screen. This is crazy. I never knew you could do that. My mind is just now blown. We can drive with the map on. Wow. Just now figuring this out. That's amazing. I'm gonna throw on the buzz bait again. Hopefully we can make something happen with it. <laughs> buzz bait in the middle of the street. Buzz bait. Use some chicken liver and pantyhose. Up for six hours. School is too hard. Oh my goodness. Well, it sounds like you're putting in the work and that's what matters. 110 pound flathead. Wow, that is a big flathead, Cody. What do you think Ultimate Fishing Sim? I think Ultimate Fishing Sim is uh, is is pretty neat in the way that they have a trophy lodge and they have some fish that we can't really fish for. They have ice fishing, they have fly fishing, um, a lot of different stuff that we don't have in Fishing Planet. Um, and that's about it. I I don't think that the game itself is better than Fishing Planet, even with those features. But uh, but it's still a fun game in its own way. It's kind of like Hunting Simulator 2 when it came out, and people were like, "But it has dogs and it has pheasants. It's gotta be." it's got to be better than the hunter call of the wild and and we we're like yeah i mean it has those things but it's not going to be a better game than the hunter call of the wild <laughs> that's kind of how i feel about ultimate fishing simulator and ultimate hunting but but we'll see i i it would be nice to be pleasantly surprised you know nice old trophy butterfly peacock that was awesome
I'm gonna say, I wonder if I have anything that we could try to catch a buffalo. I'm trying to think. Bent your finger 90 degree angle. Oh my god. Backwards? Because <laughs> I mean, I mean, yeah, that's 90 degrees right there. I just did it, but it didn't break my finger. I'm assuming backwards. Teach you how to fly fish. Hey, you're right on. I, I do enjoy fly fishing. I, I caught a few. Well, it, you probably already heard me say that. I caught a few uh, little little uh, fish today on my fly fishing rod. That was fun. I enjoyed that. I think the fly fishing rod just has a it just has a great feel to it. Even when you have a small fish on a fly fishing rod, it, it feels it feels nice. I don't know. There's something about fly fishing. And the thing that gets me about fly fishing is that once I understood that it was basically just bobber fishing with a lure, then I really enjoyed the concept of fly fishing. Aiden Halffield, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. You rented a boat and it wouldn't let you drive it. Oh no. Is the bass boat worth it? Uh, I think if you buy it with your own in-game money, yes, I think it is worth it. I think it's awesome. Let's see if we can get up on this, uh, Get up on here. Go. There we go. Let's get some. Will I play ultimate fishing more or no? Yeah, I'll probably play more. How do we get snagged? Come on. Only let you go on the kayak. Huh. Did you rent the kayak or the boat? The motor boat. There's a little fish. They get a good predator rod. What's in the Everglades? A lot of bass, man. I got a lot of it. That's a shoal bass. Hey, look at that. That's awesome. Nice little shoal bass. That's one of the first uniques I caught here, actually, uh, when we had the uh, Bass Blo Explorer plaque. Gosh. I'm adding random letters to my words. The Bass Boat Explorer Pass. I, I caught a unique shoal bass. That was awesome. Um, but yeah, there's plenty of bass boats that you can buy with your in-game money. And those ones, I think, are worth it for sure. Ooh. Boy, someone tried to grab that. Big fish. Come back for it, man. God, are you serious? Come on. Back again, back again. Next year, your parents may do homeschooling, but with your little cousins and stuff, but still. Well, right on, man. Albino diamond, yeah, mine is albino diamond moose. Hey, right on, that's awesome. No, I have not gotten an albino diamond, Cody. That's uh, that's pretty cool though, man. Fly fishing, no. Nerf surgeon farming, yes. <laughs> yeah. What is the biggest fish we've caught? It's an arapaima so far. In the game, anyway.
Got your first carb yesterday. It was about three pounds. Oh my. Man, it starts there. I, I took the uh, the chef, Andrew Fontes, out today to a uh, to a creek fishing for carp. And he caught a 15 pounder. And uh, that was awesome. So that's a good sized fish. And, uh, and and with carp, that's pretty small. So, I, you know, I'm excited to get into something bigger. Backwards, I'll say. Sounds good, man. Deliciously pulp. You know, honestly, I think they decreased the amount of bites, and um, and I think they uh, made them fight harder. Yeah, Ace Noob. I I would I would venture to say that uh that neither of them are worth the money, but uh, but but do do what you want, I suppose. <laughs> oh look at that you can do half and half that's crazy bro that's crazy crazy cool yeah drag you out nose should i go back to tarpon yeah, man. There were no big swells when we were first looking for tarpon. Maybe there's a big gar in here, though. We could try to throw a minnow or something. See if we can catch a gar. Do I play fishing sim world? I don't know, Michael. You should check my my videos and see. The answer is yes. Yes, I do. Barbecue. Hello. How are you? Hey, there's fish. Whoa. Hopping, hopping. Little shoal bass. Very nice. Melanistic diamond grizzly beat. <laughs> Grizzly bear, right on. That's awesome. What's the best cast reel? You know, it honestly just depends on what your rod is. There's not the best one is if you go to the casting and you go to the very end. That's the best one. But I tell you, if you're trying to target little bass on mud water and your reel is 80 pounds of drag it's probably going to be bad so um the best reel is the one that's best for the fish you're going for and the rod you have i suppose barbecue yolo thanks for the follow man where well, there's fish right here you think this is where the big fish is maybe Jaden buckets Jaden buckets with a follow. Hey, thanks so much, man. I I'm venturing to think maybe either big mouth buffalo here or gar. Lucas plant. Thanks so much, Lucas. Let's see. Large minnow. Let's throw a large minnow in here. Let's see. Connor Duanell is back. How's it going, Connor? Oh, wrong rod. No, no, no. Know any places in NC, bro? I have to check some. I have to check some real quick. I posted something. I posted something in... Um... Yeah, look at that. Oh, can you see it? Can you see it? We have a bite too. Look at that. 
Wild Carp Classic winner, North Carolina Anglers go home $7,800. The biggest carp tournament in the United States. North Carolina, man. So there's definitely fish in North Carolina. I would guess any lake has them. If you know any lakes around near you, might have some, some big carp there. You can put any reel and any rod in UFS's ultimate fishing sim. Yeah. We had a nibble, man. Had a nibble, but then it went away. Maybe we need to put a smaller hook on. Yeah, I understand that now. Forty-four pound unique leg trout. Hey, you're right on, man. Well done. Look at all this. Look at all this over here. A diamond besieged ibex. Well, right on. That's awesome. Gonna log in the blue crab with me. Right on, man. Lucas plant. You're seventeen. Where should you fish? Probably in Naharan, I think. You unlock Everglades at 18, I think. Fish for bass in Naharan. I always enjoy fishing for bass in Naharan. Everland or New York? If, if you're talking Everglades, Everglades is definitely better. A branch! Woo, good catch. Big car, uh, big, big gar. <laughs> Forgot what I was fishing for. Uh, all these big swirls, it's gotta be a big fish. Gotta be a big freshwater fish over here. Two 50 pound grass carp in it, bro. Throw in some bait at those beasts, bro. Um, one of the Kansas City carp guys actually caught a 62 pound, 60, I wanna say it's 62 pound grass carp out of a lake here in Kansas City. Freaking massive, humongous. Just the belly was just like hanging down, it was crazy. I think the hook might be too big. I, I was wondering that myself, honestly. But I keep snagging stuff is the weirdest thing. It's the second branch we've caught. Let's try. Uh, it doesn't do that all the time, but sometimes it does. Cast out here. <laughs> big fish, big fish, catching quality twigs. I agree. Well, you know me. I'm I'm always trying to mix it up, catch something unique, and 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 then when I catch something unique, I want a unique of that unique fish. You know, it's just how I roll. Size two hooks and shiners. Ooh. We'll just have to see. Lucas Plant loves the stream. Hey, I'm glad, Lucas. Thank you. You know, I'm not a big fan of bow fishing. Of, of bow hunting for fish. So I honestly wouldn't care. Um, maybe they can put it in the Hunter Call of the Wild or something like that. Big fan for two years. Gatsau, Gatsau? Am I saying that correctly? My goodness gracious. Appreciate it, Parker. I'll just go with Parker. I like Parker. Parker's easy to say. Jesse, yo, uh, thank you, thank you. You think these are big bass? I'm not sure. So strange.
How do you drive motorboats? You go in, you turn on the engine, and you go. Bro. That's how it goes, man. A stick worth $10,000. 10000 Give me that stick. I want it for $10,000. Why does it look like it's blinking? It's so weird. <sighs> I don't know if there's gar over here or not, but we're going to have to go back to bass fishing or something because this is boring. Boring, boring, boring. Come on, big bass. Big bass. Come on, big bass. so Declan yeah just take a little bit to get there which is fine not a race cowboy bad what's going on man there is a fish see cowboy shows up and then I catch a big bass that's how it works <laughs> there we go trophy butterfly still haven't caught a darn unicorn gosh dang it gosh dang it Come on, unicorns. Cowboy, yeah, how have you been? I have been great. How have you been? Can't complain. I've been on vacation for the past week and a half or so. It's been it's been a blast. Where do I recommend to fish at level 28? You know, I'm honestly not sure. Can you go to St. Croix yet? St. Croix is a, a really nice place to fish. Otherwise, just fish wherever you want. D did you know, every fish gives experience. You can play the game and catch any fish and get experience and money. So it doesn't matter where you fish, you can just fish everywhere. You can fish everywhere and make money and experience. It's crazy, I'm telling you. If you catch a bluegill, it will give you money and experience. If you catch a bass, it will give you money and experience. If you catch it at the heron, money and experience. At Everglades, money and experience. It's crazy. Willie Ford, hi. First European monster fish, perch bully. Oh, is that what the perch bully is about? Anthony, thank you so much for the follow. We had a fish try and get it, man. Man, we need to switch back to the spinner bait. You're catching more fish on the spinner bait, I swear. Well, if if the perch bully is a monster fish, we'll have to wait till uh, Halloween. That's how that goes. We only catch monster fish during Halloween. This is a snag or a fish. Gosh dang it. Urgh, why, snags? Why? Aiden is back. We caught a boot. A oh, freak. That's not a boot. That's a shoe. Come on. Lenny Villa monster. I bet that's what's going on, though. I bet they're going to release uh, European monsters for all of the maps. And the one at Lenny Villa is the first one. Bro, this is not working. This is not working. I'm sick and tired of fishing for bass here. A branch and a boot. I hate it. 
Let's go. I hate this. This is so dumb. Catching quality twigs and boots and everything else. I'm leaving. See you later. Logs. Lots of sticks over here. Little air. That's okay. Big right turn over here. Zoomers. Oh, a little less of a right turn, I guess. Okay, 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 all right, turn right, uh, left, I mean. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. Going through trees. Seen some big fish caught over here. Not seeing anything stand out to me, though. We might just have to leave and get a medium spoon. I love using the red the red uh, tiger medium spoon. I don't know why I don't have it in my inventory. Am I fishing in a private room? I am indeed. Fishing in a private room. Threading the needle. Wow, easy peasy. But uh, but it's a it's a private room for friends only. New private room. Ah, oh, dang. My bad, bro. I thought we were fishing. I thought we were in a friends only. That was my bad. Only only um, only an hour and thirty eight minutes. Fishing in a private room without knowing. It's not bad. It's pretty good. I was bound to figure it out at some point. Oh, there's a big fish on the bottom there. Two big fish on the bottom there. Three big fish on the bottom there. Boss. Oh, we're level 57. How about that? How about that? How about that? Throw, let's throw this out here. I don't have a bell or anything, so it might be a little iffy. Judo, been a hot minute since you've caught a stream. All right, on man. Glad you're here. The map for the boat and church and perch bully is new. Oh, is it? Ooh. Season two of Monsters, yeah. The Sir Gaming. Got the Perch Bully a few hours ago, it's really easy. See? Too easy, you should have waited for Halloween. Steven Thwaites, thanks for the follow. Should have waited for Halloween, ace noob. This is why you're a noob. Because you do, you catch things and you, you don't wait for the right time. You're supposed to only catch monsters during Halloween. Duh. Come on. Cheryl Luna. Hey. The first stream Parker's caught will ride on, man. Guess they're not. They're not. They're not catching on the bottom. Throw a crab out there. I think there's some swells over here. Oh, this is a bottom as well. Gosh dang it. Didn't want to throw another bottom out. <laughs> is this game cross platform? It is, but only for a specific way. I do have a video about it. You're welcome to go watch it. Or you can just download the game on Microsoft Store, on PC, or play on Xbox. That's it. Still in the kayak, nearly there. <laughs> You're on your new PC right now. Call Wild Bow Hunter. Fantastic. That's awesome. 
What's up, man? How'd it go? He caught the biggest fish. Did you? The, the biggest, biggest fish? The biggest fish. Tell me all about it. Spotted trout. So, oh, spotted trout. Wow. Let me. I'm gonna show you everybody what I got today. Are we just. That's still cool. Number one. Yeah, you better not hit the fan. A new fishing rod. New fishing rod. Ugly stick. GX2. GX2. Ooh. Hit the fan. We're good. God damn it. Oh. The ugly stick made it through the fan. A little striped bass. Very nice. Striped bass. Oh, he scared the crap out of me. I'm just glad it didn't break. Honestly. Oh, I got a seven year old. I will not shut everything. Play up. Oh, okay. Well, we saw some big fish over here, but they didn't show up. You're not waiting for Halloween to catch a two pound fish? Bro, just cause you don't have any patience doesn't mean that you can make fun of it for being a small fish, okay? It's trying to get bigger, okay? You're just a big bully. And that's why you're an ace noob. <laughs> wow, that was mean. Hey, that's his name. Ask me if you referred to. Don't know if you should wait, bro. You you decide. You you decide. We report. You decide. You decide. Dang, it's rough. You playing PlayStation? Yeah. It is. I don't know. Never watch. Never How many people are watching? Your son Acrobat. I'm back to see you, Chris Molly. That's awesome, man. Good to see you. I'm glad I, you know, I was gone for such a while, uh, such a long while. I wasn't sure how many people would be back. I'm, I'm glad to say that many people came back. Awesome. How are you doing, Chris? How are you doing, Acrobat? I don't know why I'm just I'm just throwing rods every which way right now. I have no idea what's going on. Oh my god. Top 130 in the world for blacktail deer and classic. Well, right on. Here's a fish. Here's a fish. On the crab. What is this? A redfish? Big redfish. Trophy redfish? It is a trophy redfish. This is bigger than mine, Zachary. Egg. 47 inches long. One ninety three point three, right, right on. Call the wild bow hunter. Well done. I'm new to fishing planet. It is so fun. It is fun, Fred. Glad you're glad you're checking it out. It is a fun game. That's for sure. Where should you go after Everglades? Um, wherever you want, Jaden. That's the beauty of the game. You unlock new maps every couple of levels, so you can just go to the next one if you want. Or if, you, if you're if you just wanting to catch pike, for instance, you could go to St. Croix. Okay. Where is the best fishing river and lake and fishing planet? I have no idea, dude. What do you consider the best? If I said that the best fish 
the best best fishing spot for arctic grayling was in uh Kanique creek or something like that I, I have no idea like it's such a subjective term i guess subjective subjective it's all subjective Life motocross, but I'm doing good in some areas and men in others. Bro, tell me about it. But hey, Ooh, that's better than it being, you know, poor, you know? Sounds like you're doing okay. Glad to hear it. How am I? I just got back from a week and a half of vacations, basically. I'm, I'm doing great. You have $700, Parker says. Wow. Okay, Parker. Parker's wanting to show off, I guess. Show off his $700. <laughs> big fish, big fish, unique. This is a pretty decent sized fish. The permit? Or is it a tarpon? It's a tarpon. Hey, good deal. Dan plays. Hey, Bo, what's up? How's it going, Dan? Well, what's up? We just got a tarpon on. Otherwise, this fishing day has been pretty bland, to be honest. Oh, it was a good recharge. It, it was indeed, man. I'm back with renewed vigor and like half terabyte of uh videos <laughs> what are you doing now oh well thank you did those work no they didn't we got three did you yeah better than what i did i guess uh yeah All right, looks like he might have. Nope. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say looks like he might have beached himself, but uh, he did not. This is uh, this is one of my stronger rods too, so it must be a pretty decent size. I don't want to hold my breath and, and hope that he's a uh, he's a unique though, just because I don't know. Uh, he, he did beach himself. I'm guessing a trophy. Trophy tarpon, 69 pounds. How about that? 69 pound tarpon. That's pretty cool though. Have to go eat or your roommate is going to yell at you. No, we can't have that. Well, take care, Squish. Have a good one. Go eat some food. You deserve it. That's a nice little tarpon there. Can't complain about that. 3,700 bucks, 1,700 XP. And we'll throw it out there for another one. We only have one minnow left, though. How to catch pike at Lenny Villa? I, I don't have any tips for that, Eli. I don't know, man. Beezy Hub Mom is here. Hi, Beezy Hub Mom. Ace Noob says, flow rod, one-aught hook, small minnows. Yeah, go for it. Other than Everglades ran into you. Well, young Skip, right on, man. Glad you did. Ooh. Beeping on both rods. Ooh. How, how was your day? How was your day, mom? Went there, used casting spoon two to one in size. Yeah, a casting spoon could work. That's that's pretty good. Yeah. Go with that. Try that. I feel like Everglades just eat up way too much money. 
Uh, it depends on how big your uh, your keep net is because you can catch so many fish at Everglades But if you don't have a large enough keep net, then yeah, it does cost a lot of money I was very skeptical when it came to uh, Everglades until I started catching fish that were giving me 800 to a thousand dollars a piece and then I was like okay this this is all right I could I could fish here yeah there you go drag yacht what do I think the coolest monster fish is uh either the the tarpon or uh or the frankenfish I can't remember what the tarpon's name is the frankenfish is pretty cool even if he's one of my smaller ones that I caught. I mean, this model is just cool. With all the different fish parts. And, uh, and this guy, I think... Oh, this is actually the Krampus fish. Never mind. Not the one I'm looking for. Did I already pass him? Surely not. So we already passed him. There he is. The terror tarpon. I love the terror tarpon with all these hooks in his mouth and his fin and all that sort of stuff. I think that's really cool. 75 pounder. I like tarpon though, so maybe I'm just biased. What's the best casting rod under level eight? I don't, I don't know. I don't know, Anita. Sorry. I don't have them in front of me, so I can't really look at them. Man, it's to jump the boat outside the barriers. Oh my. Oh my. Pretty decent fishing right here. We're just not catching anything. I threw this out. There we go. Big fish. Big. Oh, it is a pretty decent. At least. Is it going to be big? I. I have not been able to hit this. This darn. Uh, unicorn button this whole time. So. So please be an unicorn. Coming straight ass now. I still don't even know what it is. We haven't seen anything about it. We don't know what it is. Everyone type in, what do you think this is right now? We haven't seen it. It hasn't surfaced at all. Which seems so strange, because usually we can at least see its fin sticking up out of the water or something. It's a, a black drum or a red fish usually or the tarpon splashes a lot. Oh, oh it might just be a regular little black drum. From what I saw, it looked kind of like a little black drum. Timothy Descato says tarpon. Just killed your first buck in the night in uh, classic. Cool, right on. Fishing with you right now. The best place to level up, by the way. It, it all depends on what your level is, man. I would I would follow along with my beginner series. I think he's a little black drum. That or he's a giant. Yeah, he is a black drum. I don't think he's Noonie though. I think he's another trophy. Yep, that's our biggest one that we've caught so far though. 58 pounds. We've caught a 56 and a 54 today. 
58 though is not bad gosh dang it just caught a shark in real life dang man what kind of shark was it oh he just threw it out there and it's already beeping again Oh, there it goes. Twenty-two pounds. And young Skip, you should be just fine. You should be making all sorts of money at Everglades, man. Oh no, I missed it. Who just followed? I missed it. Tell me. Please. Retro, what's up, BZ? How's it going, Retro? Another black drum. Black drum are going crazy on the crab right now. live on twitch no not live on youtube can't you tell just trying to get the frog you saw me use it the everglades the frog is a game changer man Swam with a nurse shark. Cool, right on. I really wanted to ask if it healed your wounds, but I thought that would be really punny. So I decided not to. Still some beeping going on over there. Getting a twitch, so yeah, I used the frog, Jaden. I didn't use the frog popper. Where's the best place on Lone Star to catfish? Just, just toss it out. Toss out some dog food or some out into the deep, into the deeps, the deepest part of the of the pond, the lake. I guess it's a very small lake. John Carlo is here. How's it going, John Carlo? Stingray in the Dominican Republic. Hey, right on. That's awesome. Sounds like a fun time. Gonna go to bed. Hey, I want to go to bed too, but we we need to catch one more fish. One more is all we're missing. I thought we'd get something with this darn casting spoon with it being glow in the dark and all that. Looks like boss got a little tarpon over there. Walkie, walkie's here. Was my biggest deer? I don't know, man. Gosh dang, it's so close. Sewell, hi. 
on your bottom rods while I fish for bass in the Everglades? That's a great question. I'm not really sure. I never used any bait when I was in the Everglades. I was too busy trying to catch stuff with the other rods. I was always catching stuff with the other rods. Don't end the stream till an uni. No. I have way too much stuff to work on, man. Forty-three pound tarpon, nice. Go to the real Everglades in real life. I was really close, man. I uh, I didn't go to the Everglades, but I definitely kayaked through more of this kind of area that I'm at with blue crab right now. Okay, well, unfortunately, the fish are not biting in it right now. We're five, we're almost we're three minutes over time, and there's a bunch of calamity going on outside the room with the dogs right now. So I'm going to get off. Hopefully, you're all doing well. Excited to be back into the streams. We'll see you on Monday, and I hope to get out some videos here soon. This thing likes to beat, but they just are not, they're not biting it. Anyway. Take care, everyone. We'll see you next time. If you haven't hit the like button, consider doing so. Subscribing, maybe, if you haven't done that either. And uh, we'll see you on Monday, okay? Take care, everyone. And as always, remember. One family.